Oh, that several of the bald eagles that nest in Jackson County flew all the way to Canada and beyond last year. That information was gathered through a program where our national birds are tagged with GPS transmitters to track their flights. Bill Snyder shows us the process. So you might recognize this eagle's nest at the Mississippi Sandhill Crane Wildlife Refuge in Goche. You might remember last year we were out here when they put bands and GPS on a couple of eagles. Well, within four or five months, they grow and end up migrating away from Jackson County to points as far away as Canada. We start watching for them in October when they show back up and then we'll uh, kind of notice it in December usually that uh, we have one actually sitting on the nest. And when he sees the eaglets, he calls in Mississippi Power, the Mississippi State Extension Service, and the Fish and Wildlife Bureau. I think it's a great opportunity for us to get out here and see this firsthand. Uh, we, uh, we really appreciate the partnership that we have with uh, Mississippi State. They come out with a marsh buggy, get in the bucket truck, get the eaglets, then bring them in for banding and testing. So last year was the first year we put a transmitter on it. Um, and we had the two nestlings last year. This year we have two nestlings, but last year we only put a transmitter on one. This year with the two, we can see if they travel together. As this bystander looks on, the eaglets are banded, they've got their GPS transmitters, and they're also checked for health concerns. In fact, one of the two three-month-old eaglets this year has a beak issue. It looks different to us. It's an anomalous. We don't know what the cause is, but that this bird is healthier and it actually weighs a little bit more than its uh, nest mate suggests that it's eating enough and, and pretty well fed. With this eagle banding, they can learn more about how our national bird migrates around the country. In Goche, Bill Snyder, WLOX News Now. And once the process is complete, the birds are returned to the nest. The program is in its fifth year.